Farming in Upper Michigan is growing amid challenges. That was the message today at the Michigan State University Agriculture for Tomorrow conference in Escanaba. TV6's Escanaba Bureau reporter Barbara Bellinger asks an organizer about trends and challenges the UP farming industry faces. The director of Michigan State University's Upper Peninsula Research and Extension Center says UP farmers of today face decades-old challenges. Where do I get seed and fertilizer? Or where do I sell the products that I'm growing on my farm? Those, those continue to be challenges today as they have been for many, many years. D. Decker organized today's Agriculture for Tomorrow conference. He says some farming challenges could also be beneficial. For example, what does climate change mean for agriculture here in the UP. In some, in some ways, that could actually be a benefit, right? Maybe a longer growing season. Maybe we can increase the diversity of products that we're, we're growing and producing here in the region. Conference attendees included beginner and experienced farmers and backyard gardeners. I just went to the one that was talking about the regulatory environment for food safety. And um, I was a little apprehensive because I, I just have a garden, and I, but if I was to get engaged at the farmer's market, and something like that, what, would, would that affect me? Keynote speaker, UP historian Russell Minyagi, says farming trends in the UP ebb and flow. Today, it's on a rise because people want to, again, following the old practice of being able to, to farm the area and to have crops that where you don't have to pay a transportation fee. D. Decker added that one of the biggest trends seen now in the UP is growth in the number of very small farms and beginning farmers. Barbara Bellinger, TV6 News, Escanaba.